All right, what is up guys? So in this video, I'm going to be replacing the thermal paste on this GPU with some Arctic MX4. The thermal paste that is currently on this GPU is a cheap generic one. I have seen the temperatures go up and it's just everywhere. So I wanted to replace it with something that's actually good. So yeah, let's go ahead and start uh, taking this apart. For this, uh, for this 1080 uh, by Asus, it's pretty simple to take apart. There's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six screws. All right, so all the screws are now removed. This one will open like so, so just flip it over. You can shake it a bit and it just opens like a clamshell, there you go. You can see the cooler and you can see the, the chip right there. And then all I'm going to do is clean this up and uh, put in some brand new thermal paste. Okay, as you can see, there is thermal paste around the chip. Um, but I never cleaned that anymore. Um, what was it? I had an RX, I think it was RX 570, an AMD uh, GPU. I was cleaning the thermal paste around the chip and you see these little uh, capacitors. But I was cleaning it, I was cleaning the thermal paste around it. One of them broke off and I don't even know, I don't remember if the GPU worked when that happened or not. This was a while ago, it's like four years ago. Um, so after that happened, I never, I never cleaned the outside of the chip anymore. So I just leave it like that. So if, uh, if you're wondering why I didn't clean it, there you go. All right, now for the cooler. All right, that's as clean as it's gonna get. Not to, not to apply our thermal paste. Yeah, let's start from here. And I'm gonna be using the applicator to spread it out. That's good enough. I'm um, just gonna go ahead and install this back. So, yeah, I'm gonna leave this flat. So, I'm gonna close it up. Gonna line it up with the screw holes. Oh, God. It's lined up. There you go. That's good enough. I'm just gonna hold it from the bottom and install one of the screws. Just to hold it. All right, so that is done. I replaced the thermal paste with some actual good thermal paste. The thermal paste that was on the GPU was um, a very cheap thermal paste I bought from eBay. Um, and I wouldn't recommend buying cheap thermal paste. Uh, just pay the extra pay the extra money for um, for like a good good one. That thermal paste is gonna live there forever. But there you go. That's it for this video. If you have any questions, uh, leave a comment. Other than that, thank you guys for watching.